if you find yourself battling with printing problems, such as oozing, bubbling or stringing coming through your printer nozzle, it is likely that the issue is caused by excess moisture within your filament. We often find that many of the 3D printing issues that we come across are caused by excess moisture within the filament. This is usually distinguished by the hissing or crackling noise while extruding. Hello and welcome again to another one of our video tutorials. My name is Ryan and today I will be discussing the importance of drying filaments for 3D printing. As some of you may already know, certain types of plastics have the ability to absorb moisture from the surroundings. This is called hydrolysis and it affects polymers in the way that it creates a break in the polymer chain. It reduces the mechanical properties of the material, making it weaker and more difficult to print. We can prevent this by drying the material at a specific time and temperature to evaporate any moisture from within the filament. With 3D printing, it is good practice to keep your filaments dry rather than drying continuously before every print. To do this, you should store your filaments in a dry box or cabinet. When printing, print directly from the dry box. Check the technical data sheet of the material for the correct drying conditions for that filament. Perform a test print with the wet material and another test with the dry material and compare these tests. Use colour changing silica or a normal silica with a hygrometer to check the humidity levels within your dry box. This way we know when the silica gel needs to be dried again. With this video you should now know the symptoms of a wet filament, how to dry the filaments and more importantly how to keep them dry. Thanks for watching, please subscribe to our channel if you don't want to miss out in any of our next videos. Give us a like, if there's any topics or any questions you would like me to answer, please leave a comment down below and I'll see you in the next one. BASF. We create chemistry.